All right, hi to everybody. <laughs> Got Myrtle Beach on today. So, yeah, see? All right. Look what we're getting ready to do. We're getting ready to put the tub in the new compartment with the new wall moved this way. And uh, I just want to get an idea of what it's going to look like when it gets in there. So I figured I'd take you with me. Check you out a little bit. All right, just bear with me here a sec. Doing this with one hand while I'm filming. <laughs> oh, 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 all right, there we go. Something like that, all right? Look at that. No, I have to figure out a few things. Where I want to hang my box. Remember I told you that I think it's going to be, if I put it on this wall, it's going to be too far out. Looks like that's the case. Looks like I'm going to put it on that wall right there. And, uh, I also need to figure out the height of everything. I, I do plan on putting a 2x6 uh, a in. Here's my plan. I'm going to put 2x6 across the front. And where the legs are, I'm going to run a 2x6 from, the, from this 2x6 to, uh, to the bottom plate in the back. So there's going to be a 2x6 here, 2x6 here, and a 2x6 here. So it's going to be almost like a ladder laying down, but there's not going to be a two by six behind there. So the reason for that is I want to put insulation. I want to put the, the poly board inside my, when I put my two by six down next to the concrete, I, I'm, I'm trying to prevent, uh, well, I'm not going to prevent it, but I'm trying to reduce the amount of heat loss. Like when, when the tub is being used, hot water, you know, I don't want, uh, I don't want, I'm trying to reduce the, the heat loss. So that's what I got to figure out. Then I also need to figure out where I want to put my braces for my grabs. And uh, I need to figure out, yeah, so I, I have a few things to do, which is good. The first thing I want to do is get the box in. I want, I want to wire the box, get that done. So I'm going to put... I also I need to figure out how high if there's a difference between these wheels and a two by a two by is inch and a half, so the wheels might actually be a little bit higher than the, the two by. Right. Yeah, it's hard to tell because this these wheels have a little divot, so it, it's going to be close. So that's what I got to do. Those are that's my next uh, objective. But look at that, we got real good distance away from this wall we've got real good distance away from this wall uh, the back shelf is I want that to be the, the deepest because that's going to be like a shelf so I don't know how far I want to move it up here because the tile is going to end uh, somewhere around here right so I want the tub to be within the tile, uh, actually in further from the tile, right? Let's see, do I want that? Yeah, uh, that's something else I gotta think about. So, um, yeah, that's what I gotta figure out. That's what I'm gonna be, that's what I'm gonna be doing in the next few. Uh, but first thing I wanna do is get my, my box, my box installed and Get that all done. I'm not going to. I'm not going to energize the. Uh, once I get the outlet in and all that, I'm not going to. I'm not going to energize. Well, uh, I will eventually because I want to make sure I'll, I'll put a, a tester in, make sure it's wired properly. And oh, I got my ground connector. Hold on, let me show you those. Here's my little hooks. My little. Uh, I'm going to call them grounding hooks. I couldn't get green, so because they only came red black, so I'm going to use a black one. Uh, and I need to find, that's a pretty good size hole right there, right? But it's meant for 8 gauge, or 10 to 8 gauge, I think. But uh, I'll, I'll, that's going to be what I fasten my ground to, the chassis ground somewhere, once we find a good chassis ground. So I'll be doing that, uh, well not today, but you know, eventually. Uh, but I am going to use one to connect to the ground in the box, and uh, maybe I'll show you that. All right. 
All right, let me get going. Um, I want to take a measure from here to here. I get my two by six cut, and then I'll figure out the measure from that two by six back to the bottom plate to uh, make my three cuts. So, because it, it's going to sit on top of the two by six, like I said. Uh, so that's going to be just heightening. Instead of having the legs go on the concrete, I figured an inch and a half is not going to ma matter, and it'll allow me to put some insulation in there and make it all nice. So that's what I'm going to do. All right, I'll leave you with that shot right there. We're going to be uh, we're going to be busy for a little while. All right. All right thanks for watching. Stay tuned. More to come.